yo what is going on guys we are back with another legends video and here today um we're going to be talking about the little teaser that uh legends had put out um a few hours ago now i actually was awake at the time i even i even quote retweeted the uh hint picture right actually always oh, there's a lot of people who love when they do stuff like this right but uh i did quote retweet and i had put three question marks because i'm like what does the grass mean right C could they finally be telling legends players to you know go outside for a little bit right because all, all, all we do is just stay inside and play pvp and get angry at a mobile game right but but seriously uh i i was a little confused at first right but then you know i obviously i waited i waited to see what other people had in mind and then once people put twin uh, who once people put pin right i was like oh that makes a lot more sense um it definitely does look like we might be getting some superhero content and it actually does make sense considering they literally just zenkai'd um the blue pan right who actually is pretty good i do have to make a showcase on her she's actually one of the few zenkai units who i'm actually excited to use but that's besides the point they just zenkai'd her her zenkai ability is blue uh sun family right um this pan obviously is also going to be sun family she could be blue when she releases right but um so yeah it looks like pan from dragon ball super superhero might be coming to the game and it may seem that superhero might actually be the legends festival right uh we all thought it would be centered around gt because again the blue pan zenkai and then before that the free to play 17 we started gravitating more towards gt right so it made sense in everyone's head that we could be seeing something gt for the legends festival right which um there's also is a lot of speculation about the legends festival beginning earlier than usual for the past two years from when ui sign dropped and then last year the uh you uh the blue goku and vegeta slash spirit sword trunks we always got legends festival at the end of uh november and it will go on until like the beginning of january right but it seems like they might take the anniversary route where um they're gonna have it last longer they're gonna have the celebration last longer so if they do want to do that and still have it and um at the beginning of january they're gonna have to begin early which is why everyone is speculating that we might start legends festival literally here in the next week or two right we might actually see uh the first batch of units come literally in two weeks max right so that there is a speculation behind that i'm pretty sure there's a video on stuff literally upcoming on monday or tuesday i think right one of these days uh, there is a video and stuff coming out, or, or reveal and stuff, I should say, right? So, uh, we will see what they have to announce there. So, if it is um, Legends Festival and all that, we might actually see Dragon Ball Super Superhero instead of GT, which is what everyone thought, which is actually, I think I would prefer that because the movie released in June for a for, for Japan, and we got it in August, and we still haven't seen not one thing besides Game and Game 2, who Dokkan is actually just about to get, but. Um, obviously, like we, we, we have them since like April, right? But that's besides the point. We have gotten nothing ever since both of the, the, the movies have released for both Worldwide and Japan. So we're finally getting some stuff. I would rather have a Dragon Ball Super Superhero now and then get something GT related later because you can always get something GT related, but you can just make it wait to get movie stuff that released months ago, right? That, that dropped months ago. It just made no sense, right? So it, it would actually be really, really good if they do center Legends Festival around that moment for Super Super Hero, right? That's that gonna be annoying to say, but um, we'll just say Super Hero. But yeah, it does seem like we might be seeing Pan. Uh, she will probably be, she'll probably be the first character that they reveal in the reveal and stuff, right? And we might, you know, who knows? We might see a LFB Gohan slash Horn Fiddle, right? We might see a Cell Max, right? Because uh, there is also speculation around the fact that they might be introducing giant characters in this uh reveal and stuff right they might have finally found a way to make giant characters playable and if they do that just opens the doors to to a lot of uh other characters right we could get all the giant apes we could get a playable harutagarn obviously we already have him in the game but we could ha like actually probably control him so yeah that would open the doors to a lot more uh other characters in the game but uh yeah with that being said let me know what you guys think i can only talk so much about uh what this teaser means but this does make the most sense obviously you don't see the grass flowing around pan here but in the trailers literally i think every trailer they showed pan powering up um you would see grass flow around her right which is where the idea actually came from so uh yeah but with that being said let me know what you guys think this hint means let me know if you guys think it means it means something else right uh be sure to let me know all your ideas down below let me know if you're excited for potential superhero content coming up and with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, guys did, make sure you guys hit that like button, hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I'll see you all in the next one.